Welcome back to Africa 54. The tributes continue to pour in for actor Philip Seymour Hoffman. As suspects arrested in connection with his death appeared in court. Lights were dimmed outside of the Broadway theaters along New York's 42nd Street in display of honor and respect for the three-time Tony nominee. Meanwhile, three suspected suspects rather arrested on drag allegations stemming from the investigation into Hoffman's death appeared in night uh, court on Wednesday. Police found Hoffman's cell phone number after reviewing the phone records of the suspects as part of its investigation into whether they may have supplied Hoffman with drugs. An autopsy of the Oscar-winning actor was ruled inconclusive Wednesday and more tests will be needed uh, to determine what caused his death. Well, next one of America's idols, most famous contestants, is living his fate up to American voters once again. This time in a bid for Congress in North Carolina, Clay Aiken, a Democrat, officially launched his campaign on Wednesday. In a nearly five-minute video posted on his new campaign website, the 20, uh, th 2003 American Idol runner referred to his upbringing by a mother who fled domestic violence. Aiken also talked about his life beyond the golden ticket of Idol. Aiken has been outspoken on gay rights after coming out and making his life as a gay father public. Now, uh, another milestone for David Beckham. The former England captain announced that the, he would be exercising his long-held option to buy into a major league soccer franchise in Miami. First, Beckham and local officials must choose that location for a soccer-specific stadium, which would be funded by the new owners. But Beckham's big day didn't end as planned. The star uh, had uh, prearranged a meet and greet with fans, uh, but had to cut his visit a bit short for safety reasons, as hundreds of fans and photographers turned up for this star's arrival. And that is what's standing today.